welcome to another short video uh, from my channel uh, the topic is uh, how to change email content without any knowledge of code that means if you do not know any HTML or CSS programming but um, don't be worried about that because I will teach you how you can change any kind of contents of your email templates okay so in this case what are the tools actually we will need to edit the content of, of the email all right number one we will need the notepad plus plus which is a free tools from Microsoft and you can download it from on their platform I mean a website and then we will need the Google Chrome the internet browser and then a MailChimp account because uh, as uh, the email templates do not have the actual uh, email templates uh, actually just show the images which is hosted in different server or different places so that we need to host our images we need to host our videos okay and for this purpose we will use MailChimp as MailChimp offers a free account for 2000 subscriber for free all right and the template we need to edit this four thing we will need to um, you you know we will need to use to edit or change the content number one notepad Google Chrome MailChimp account template you need to edit okay so let's go ahead here is uh, the fact my account and I will open this is the template okay right this is the template we will change for example we'll change and this header and this paragraph this image or uh, the website address as well okay and uh, if you want to you can also change the main image here the main header image okay so how will uh, the first stage or first step we will follow that is we will open this template with the notepad plus plus on the desktop I have the template just right click off your mouse edit with notepad then place this one at the left side left side you can use at the window key of your computer and the left arrow key or right arrow key to place the active window and another window and then press window key of your PC and press left all right to place the proper uh, you know placement now we will change the header this is my headline for the email just highlight it then copy control C copy and on this editor notepad press control F then control V okay and then click find next software will find the main text on this page you will need to just change the sentence or the zoom here okay so when we copy the text and paste on notepad plus plus then control F and it will pop up a window that is a finding pop-up page and then paste on the 
find word box then click find next it will highlight the sentence where it's written okay now if you write anything here for example if you write just like um, in this place your headline a headline will be okay uh, I'm not a native English guy for that very reason maybe my English is not as good as you expect I'm really sorry about that okay then uh, control S it will save the text and just refresh it and you notice in the place your headline will be okay if you want to change it again then go ahead and just in this place in this place your headline will be again just control s and then just refresh in this place your headline will be okay it it has been changed and as the paragraph is just under the headline here so you will notice here is the paragraph a portion okay here is the first option there is last sentences book here and here is the last last word I'm sorry last word is book also okay so just change hi there this is my first email template and I am trying to change the text and images for my personal I don't know purpose maybe the spelling is not okay all right so this is the first uh, paragraph just hit control s for save then refresh it hi there this is my first email template and I'm trying to change the text and images for my personal purpose and next if you do not want this portion just highlight this from P means paragraph and this is the starting and this is the closing okay and just highlight this section and press delete press ctrl s and then refresh you should notice the paragraph has been deleted okay another section we will now change the image so already we have learned how to change the text of the template this is very easy just uh, copy control C copy on the text editor control F on the find what box paste the sentence and find next it will highlight the sentence where it is okay then just click and then just change the sentence and save it control s and refresh it so already we know how to change uh, the text of an email template now we will need to change the image of the template all right so first of all we will also copy the image as the image does not actually exist on the main site or on the template itself so it is actually a linked code that is a source code where the image is located that means a server is hosting this image and also showing the image through a URL so we will we'll need to copy the URL of the image so how can we do that hover over the image right button click of your mouse and here you will see the copy image address copy image address copy the image address on the notepad 
press Ctrl F again, Ctrl V and then find next. The software will show me a link of the image where we will replace uh, uh, with the URL of our expected image. Alright, so this is the source image link. Okay. Uh, SRC means the source so we will change this image link with our expected image link as I have already said that we will need a MailChimp account MailChimp account actually we will use MailChimp to host the images okay on my MailChimp account you will see hundreds of email templates I have designed for my buyers so dear friends if you need any responsive email news uh, email or newsletter you just need to contact with me on Fiverr.com or you can send me any comment or write any comment all right so on this MailChimp account we will host our expected image so on this account we will host our expected image uh, to host the image or to get the expected link uh, just we need to log into the MailChimp account then click on the template and on this section or on this page we will need to click on the file manager and there we will have two options to upload the images from the URL from a Flickr or Giphy or from any specific URL or from your computer click on the upload and then just make a choice of your expected image for example for example any any image okay desktop music picture save picture I don't have any image on this computer because very recently I have reinstalled the windows okay so we can I'm just pausing the video for a couple of seconds alright so in order to host we will upload our expected image that I have collected already for this tutorial purpose not any commercial purpose which is this US dollar image okay so we will upload click on the upload and select the image then open it will upload on MailChimp server and also will give you a link what we will do we will just copy the link here is the notification that the URL of this specific image on this section we will have the image editing option and on this image editing option you can resize the image and you need to be sure that your image should be 600 pixel width apply save let it be saved copy the URL go back to your editor and replace the link then save it open your template preview as you have already replaced the link of image and saved also then you need to refresh it then it will be changed here it is okay so my image is also been changed and now we will change uh, the image of the header this image okay so as always just uh, right button click of your mouse then copy the image address and on uh, the text editor press ctrl F then ctrl V 
and find next it will highlight the link as uh, the previous one has been shown and on this case we will change or we will replace uh, the link of this very image so on MailChimp we I have lots of images in this case I will change uh, the image I will change the link of any image of my expected you know image size any one let's say this one okay or any image which is or any image which is uh, 600 pixels so let's copy the URL and then replace Control V, Control S, and then refresh it. Perfect. My header image is also changed. So already we have learned how to change the text of the email template and how to change the images of of the template as well. So thank you very much for this, uh, for watching this tutorial, and I'm sorry if this video making so uh, long. It's already 18.35 minutes. Okay, thank you very much.